Hello everyone. Hope you are doing well. In this tutorial I'll show you the water simulation fill up in different shape with Phoenix FD. In easy and simple steps. Please like and subscribe my channel for more informative videos. So let's start. Here is the star shape fountain model you can see. For water source you can make create the circle shape. Adjust it in the center of the fountain. Make it editable poly. Select the top polygon. And set the polygon material ID from the modifier. Set the number. So now you have to go the Phoenix FD toolbar. Add the Phoenix FD liquid source. On the viewport. Then go to the liquid modification option. Add the water source object. Scroll down. And set the polygon ID. And in the outgoing velocity. You can increase the power of the water flow. The go to the Phoenix FD toolbar again. Click on the Phoenix FD liquid simulator. And add on the screen around the fountain. In the simulator modifier option. Go to the grid option. You can adjust the size here. In the container wall option. Select the both jammed on all axis. In the preview option. You can mark the show mesh to see the liquid. So first let's try the simulation it's working good or not. Start the simulation. You can see water liquid is working. Increasing the time configuration limit. We need to increase the frame of timeline bar. In the simulator dynamic option. You can use the initial fill up option. percentage which you have to set. That according to the model. You can change the gravity if need. In the water liquid option. We need to increase the pressure. The start and let's see. Now you can see the initial fill up. Which is going out of the model. So the question is how we can adjust the initial fill up according to the model. Stop the simulator. Always go to the zero on the timeline for to start. So now we need to create the shape like our object.
Extrude the shape. Right click and go to the object properties. Decreasing the visibility. Unmark the renderable. We don't need to show it in render. Now again right click. Go to the Phoenix FD properties. Unmark the solid object. Then OK. Now go to the helper. In the Phoenix FD. Add particle tuner on the viewport. Go to the tuner modifier option. Click on edit condition. Select the age. Select the distance to. Click on none. Select the created shape. On the left side. Select 1000. Set random between. Normally set 1 to 20. Cancel it. Go to the particle tuner option. And don't forget to mark on delete particle. In liquid simulator increasing the initial fill up. And little bit set the gravity. In liquid option. Increasing the outgoing velocity. Now let's start it. Now you can see it's working perfectly. I'm going to stop it. I think these frame will be enough. We just need to adjust the timeline bar again. Simulation is already done. You can put the material on simulator. Water liquid simulator is perfectly working. For more water simulation tutorial links down below. Please like this video and subscribe my channel. I hope this tutorial will be helpful. Thanks for watching.